Hello, poor people. So, I'm having an issue. I'm taking 10 minutes to do this. Uh, this is the third time I've tried to record this video. I'm annoyed at that. So, what I'm going to do now is try breezing through this as much as possible, counting everything that's here. I am going to tell you guys what I use for my poi. Um, just everything about it, because a lot of people ask me about this. So starting out right away, I have this bag here. $7 at a thrift store. It's a Chow brand suitcase type bag. A lot of hidden compartments in it. Perfect amount of space for everything that I own. Fuel. Coleman white fuel. The basic camp fuel that they have there. Um, you see, really cheap, sort of. It's like 10 bucks a bo uh, gallon. Um, I've been thinking maybe getting gas from a gas station might help a little better, but I think that's more dangerous. Trick Concepts Duvetine, um, because a fire blanket's always useful to have. Extra bags. Trick Concepts Spin Out Can. Has a grate on the bottom, has this nice chain here. Put your poi inside of it, spin it with the poi, holding onto the poi chains, excess fuel vanishes. Um, then you've got this little box here which I'm not going to open, but um, it's basically got my lighters, extra bags in case I need them for my poi, extra chain that came from Fire Mecca. It was the twist link. I ordered the steel chain, um, but they sent me the nickel-plated one, which sort of made me mad, and I took it off immediately because after trying to do some orbitals with them, the chain started ripping apart, and I'm wondering why that was happening extra memory card for my cameras, batteries for my glow poi, extra swivels, large and small, safety pins in, in case I need to, sorry, large, small swivels, batteries and memory card. Um, and in here, I have safety pins of various sizes in case I need to pin something up. Jumping into the poi, we've got my sock poi, which are from Home of Poi. They're the, um, Jailhouse, rainbow color, nebula things. I can't remember what color they were actually. The heads that I have in them aren't tennis balls, but they're these glow poi from Fire Mecca. Sorry, now from Home of Poi as well. Um, I didn't like these, so once they broke on me, which this right here broke pretty quickly. Not the chain, or not the link, but this part. Um, I just started using them as tennis balls to fill the poi with. The fire poi that I use um, are a mishmash of things. Two inch heads, uh, cathedral heads from Trick Concepts. The ring here broke on that, so I ended up replacing it with a um, split chain or a split ring, like a key ring, half an inch. I'm, I've got a hundred of them coming in the mail so that I can do that with the rest of them because I love those. The soldered rings have a tendency to break attached to a quick link which was attached to a swivel and another quick link which is why I have the swivels in there. I took those off, shortened the chain by doing so which I sort of got annoyed by but outside of that it's exactly what I want. The handles are the single loop handles leather from Fire Mecca. Um, came with the double loop, took the double, the second one off to get used to single loop and these ones became much more comfortable. Um, fantastic poi overall, uh, just what I would recommend is probably buying the parts to make it yourself so that um, you don't come with the prefab extra parts that some companies like to put, like Fire Mecca. Um, I'm probably not going to order much from Fire Mecca anymore, Trick Concept seems to do a much better job at everything. Um, Flow toys. I'm mad at myself because I broke them within the first week of having them. One of the lights doesn't come on. I'll probably get that replaced soon because of the um, lifetime warranty that they have. Ten bucks to get an entirely new flow toy uh, replaced by sending this one in. The, it's attached to the fl uh, flukes up there and the flow leash here. It's their flow cord, new stuff, sexy new swivels here. Um, from top to bottom, I measured it out to be 25 inches, um, cut the cord down here and heated it up right here so that um, it was exactly the length that I wanted and needed it to be. These ones are 22 inches from tip 
to bottom over here. These ones are short, much shorter than that because they stretch out. Hopefully, this gives you guys a good idea of what I spin with. I'm going to be getting a new setup fairly soon. I've got two new sets of poi coming in the mail. One chain poi, supreme heads with ball handles, and one set of just heads that are streamers. Um, flag poi type thing. Not flags, but tailed poi. Um, so yeah, that's what I use. Hopefully this is helpful to you guys. If you have any questions about some of the stuff, go ahead and ask me. And I will gladly tell you about it. Um, as well as pricing, I'll, I will put the websites in the comments below so that you know where I got this stuff. All right? Home of Poi, Fire Mecca, and Trick Concepts. I will say that Fire Mecca does have decent stuff. It's just they don't really have... Um, the aesthetic that I want in my fire stuff. So, if you buy anything from them, I recommend either buying their Glow Poi, their Glow Toys, or their regular um, flowy stuff like um, contact juggling balls or clubs or whatnot. Alright, hopefully this is helpful again. Um, and if anyone can recommend better stuff to me, then go ahead. Um, my issue is that I'm in California, so I'm not going to be ordering from Home of Poi too terribly often because shipping really gouges me at that point. Even the flow toys were a little bit expensive because of the shipping, but it was worth it to me. Alright, so yeah, anyway, hope to see you guys soon, and hopefully this has been useful, like I've said three times now. Bye.